7. Common Online Marketing Mistakes Most Newcomers Make Most newcomers struggle with online marketing because the approach they use and the efforts they put into it are misplaced. Others do all the right things, but fail at patience. Are you in the process of turning ideas into ready-to-sell products? Do you already have some products or services to offer? Whenever better products or services exist in competition to your offer, reinventing what you have may be the first step towards profits. Here are seven common online marketing mistakes newcomers make. 1. Not a money niche point One of the first questions that pops up when starting your internet marketing endeavors refers to picking the right niche. It's fine to pick a niche you're passionate about, but if that market is not a money niche you simply have a new hobby. Do yourself a big favor and pick a money niche you are passionate about. Tip, research Amazon, eBay, Clickbank.com, Dummies.com or Magazines.com and have a look at the best-selling categories and titles. Your money niche is right there. 2. Not capturing client details, the main goal of your website should be to capture leads in order to send information, tips, offers, newsletters, etc. To the people who are most likely to spend money on your products and services, tip, offer a free ebook, audio, or video course and make sure it's of high quality and provides valuable insights. Point 3. No follow-up, what happens after you've captured the data of your interested visitors? When talking to newbies the answer is often not much. It's imperative to start building a relationship with the people who were willing to share their details with you, otherwise you might have lost some potential customers forever. Tip, always follow up with an email, a newsletter, or even better a phone call if you asked for a number in the opt-in box. Point 4. No upsell. Point 1 slash 3 of people will buy something complimentary at the point of sale when offered. Unfortunately, most newcomers don't have an upsell tip, make sure you have at least one upsell at every point of sale. Point 5. Inconsistency Posting consistently, developing new products and services regularly, and keeping customer engagement alive is crucial. Many newcomers do little in each of these areas, limiting the growth and success of their online efforts. Tip, do a B split tests and find out what works best for your business and niche. Point 6. Lack of a clear call to action. After doing all the hard work to get your clients onto your website, the next part, which may seem obvious but yet is highly overlooked, is asking them for a commitment to you through an action. The first step in converting regular traffic to buyers is to tell your visitors exactly what they are expected to do. Tip create clear, sweet, and concise calls to action. Point 7. Do it yourself. If you deprive yourself of outsourcing and your competitors do not, you're putting yourself out of business. Lee Kuan Yew tip, focus on what you're best at and outsource what you don't like to do or are not good at doing. Get the job done by getting the right freelancer on Fiverr.com, Elance.com, Odesk.com, etc. The most successful brands invest time and resources to ensure the website looks professional and meets the needs and expectations of the target audience. Yet, the ultimate goal of a website should be to generate money. No money, no business.